Hello, my fusion years. This is half dash dot fusion again with another video. And today we're back in slime rusher. Uh, this is to cover up for the last slime rusher video, which did not turn out so good. If you, sorry, my camera's messed up. Which did not turn out so good, if you remember. The editing got messed up. Anyway, so today we're gonna play it again, sort of make up for that. And we are on dash thing. I don't know. So. In the video, I know it was hard to tell what even happened, uh, because it was all edited wrong. But I just basically just got pogo fruit and a bunch of pink slimes and just made some money off that. And I said I might get rock slimes and grind using those. I might do a little off-game grinding. Well, as you can already see, I have done a lot more than that. Oh, gee, yeah. So first off, we might as well start with where I am right now. I am in the cave, which I bought because I got enough money. And just like, so little bit backstory here. Uh, my friend Evan, he told me that uh, Hobson here, he talks, when I was first playing Hobson, he talks about how uh, he would take this cave and he would fill it with phosphor slimes. So that, so that way they just like, you know, flow around, fly around and glow in the dark. And so he, uh, he told me, hey, I know what you should do. You should, uh, put a bunch of them in there and then put in farms with food and then, uh, don't make them have scare slime. So that way they can just fly around, eat it, and you can just suck up the ports. So I took his advice and I did it on my off cam one or my old one or whatever and it's a really good idea it really works so you guys should try it out if you have slime rancher it's a it's a really cool thing to try because it's easy and another thing you can notice i have upgraded to well that i have the jetpack i have 150 energy tank capacity and I have 30 items max in my things. And the water tank. So yeah, I upgraded a lot. I got a lot of money, so I just didn't know what to do with it. I also got Q berries. I got, and I went around because I wanted to get this Ogden Ordits, Ogden Ordits uh, trade. So I could unlock his area and then do that. And he wanted like odd onions and oka okas. So like I had a few minutes to just like, try and run and explore the new area to find those items. I didn't get it in time, but now I have odd onions and oka okas, so let me let me know down in the comments, um, well first of all, let me do, know down in the comments, uh, what slimes and what things you want me to grow, what things you want me to grow, what slimes you want me to use, maybe what slimes I should breed, stuff like that. And basically just overall what things I should do. My camera always just like tilts, I'm sorry about this guys. My camera's always weird. It just likes to tilt like that. And it looks off-centered and people with OCD, kind of like me, just find it very distracting. So I'm trying to fix it. I know this is very unprofessional, guys, but I don't care. It's, I, I want it to look nice and I didn't really notice it until right now. Whatever, I'm sorry you'll have to deal with it. My camera is an idiot. Okay, so. I also have to talk over some stuff that's happened in the other parts of the house. <sighs> so yeah, I have oak ogas, odd onions. Tell me what you guys want me to do with them. Like, you know, should I plant them or should I just get rid of them? Whatever. I also, um, over here, I made a trade with Mochi Miles and that unlocked. So we'll do that. Uh, maybe not in this episode, maybe in the next episode. Uh, but yeah. Holy two cents, I have the rock slimes, I have a bunch of them, I upgraded all the cages, and then I have pogo fruit, I have a bunch of carrots, over here I have heartbeats, and you might be wondering, Owen, you went as far as to get crystal slimes? Like, I can get the oak ogres and all onions, but you went and got crystal slimes off camera? Well, that's the thing. No, I didn't. What actually happened was, I made a trade, and the thing that they gave me was crystal plorts. 
because I had gotten like Oka Oka's not onions, so they figured, so the game thought, okay, they've seen crystal slimes, so they can get this kind of stuff. So like, okay, and they just gave it to me, so now I have crystal largo, or crystal tabbies, so that way they can also eat veggies, because that's a lot of what I have. So now I can make a whole bunch of money, and they have the heartbeats for the rock slimes over here, it's really loud. Oh, the zoo trade. Please be Ogden. Please be Ogden. Dang it, no Ogden. Bob, let's do Thora. Let's do Thora. What do you want? Uh, Tabby's pinks and a boom plort for that. I don't have any boom slimes, so I can't really do that. <laughs> anyway, so we're going to do a bit of exploring today. And hopefully we can get an Ogden Ordit. Ogden Ordits? Ordas? Something like that, I forgot his name. I'm actually gonna turn down the audio because I'm sure it's really loud for you guys. So, yeah, I'm gonna turn that down a little bit. So let's get into this. We're gonna do some exploring, some grinding stuff, I guess, because I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna do any more on this until I made an actual video. So that way, you know, you guys could all be caught up and know like, okay, so this is what's happening. Do you remember the last slime rancher videos I did? Cause like those were slime streams, I called them. Should I keep doing that? Like, should I keep doing slime streams? Is that what I do for this? Let me know down in the comments. Should I do slime streams or not? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's. Jeez, I got a lot of stuff. I'm gonna. Eh. Let's go ahead and shell these plots. Shell all the phosphor plots. Just go take a little bit. Ah, uh, remember last episode where I could barely make any money? Well, look at me now. And not much has changed because I'm still feeding pink slimes. And I'm not just burning them or throwing them in the water. Anyway, so yeah, I also did get auto feeders, so that way they wouldn't go completely hungry. You guys still need something. Um, here, I'll give you Oka Okas for now, so you guys can live off those till I go get you some heartbeats. So I will do that now. I will grab the heartbeats because they are shaped like hearts, so they are there for heartbeats. So, yeah. <laughs> and also, I, uh, just a little update thing for me. I figured out how to do something. I figured out, yeah, I figured out how to do something. I know it's strange, hard to believe. Anyway, I figured out how to add hashtags to your titles. I mean, I, I already knew that you could just put hashtag something for your title. Over. I, I've done that before. But I didn't know how to do it like how some people did it where it would appear above the title. And I looked into it. It was hard, a little bit hard to find, but I eventually found it. It is, you need to put it in the description and the first three hashtags in the description will be put above the title. So that was a nice thing for me to learn. Oh, I, okay, I gotta. They've been living in their own poop for this long, seriously. That sounds awful. Let's gather up all these carrots so that way we can make a pup, 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 pup pepperoni pizza. There's a c -c -c carrot pizza. And then we'll fill up your guys' thing with carrots. Oh, I almost forgot something to show you guys. If we go up here, here, I ex sort of, I made a coop over here for all the hen hens and stuff. And while I was exploring, I found a bunch of roosters, so I just put them in here to get breeding with all the hen hens. And yeah, and I'm actually gonna upgrade it now so that way I can, you know, get more hen hens. Uh, 
uh, let's get the vitamizer. There we go. So now, and I also put some stony ends in here so that way I don't go completely dry. <laughs> and I think if I get like enough space, like I get a whole other area, I think I'll probably do it like back, th back there. Like that's a pretty good place because that's where a bunch of hen hens and stuff spawn. And I think I'm going to make that just a bunch of coops and then have some hen hens in one coop, some stony hens in another, paint hens in another, briar hens in another. You, you get it. So, but yeah, I want your opinion on that kind of stuff. See if you guys want me to do that. So how much does the lab cost, though? 10000 I might be able to do that. <laughs> anyway, all right. So, okay, sorry guys, I had to knock up my door. So, let's just get back into this. I forgot what I was saying before. Um, yeah, I'll let you guys decide what I do with the henas and that kind of stuff. Because I want this to be a full, like, viewer-supported series. So, yeah. And I think we're going to buy the lab next... Probably if I can get enough money, which thanks to these guys right here. I probably should get enough money. I got, whoa Did I break the market? There it is Lobby lava sleep a dabba doop da da Yeah By the way, guys, uh, at the time of recording, the, sorry if I paused too much. I, I'm, I'm trying to edit out all the pauses that I do. You know, like if I just sit there blank for a little bit, like that, you know. Um, I'm trying to edit all those out because I know a lot of people have been saying, like, hey, you shouldn't pause too much. Hey, you should keep talking, keep, keep it upbeat. And yeah, I know that. It's just sometimes my mind just goes blank. Maybe I shouldn't be a YouTuber. Nah, that's pretty much everyone else does. So we're just gonna s get a bunch of plorts to sell at the market. <laughs> By the way, guys, um, there's... Why do I hear, like, the ruins noise? Oh, As I was saying, we act there's actually something currently in the works that I'm not going to talk about yet because it's not a sure thing, just an idea passed around. And if it's going to be a sure thing, if we know we're going to do it, then we'll go through with the idea. And by the way, this thing, it's going to be with, MM, it's going to be with Evan. He doesn't like me sit using his, he doesn't like me using his, um, YouTube name, so I won't call him that. Uh, it's just Evan. So, yeah, because he said he hates that channel now or something. I don't know. He hasn't posted on there for a while anyway. Either way, uh, if if channels can be linked in the iCard, I don't know if they can, but I'll see if they can. If they can, then it'll be his channel will be right there because that's who he's helping with this thing. But if I you know, can't do it, if I can't, uh, if we, well not can't, but if we don't end up doing it, then, well, I don't know, if, well, yeah, if, if the iCard thing doesn't work with his channel, it'll be in the description below, he is one of my very close friends, and by the way, just gonna talk about it. These little drop-off things, to me, they look like bendy heads, because they kind of have that curve, and then it just goes around like that. But then, it wasn't until, like, a few weeks ago that I look at them, like, wait a minute. That's a slime face. <laughs> I didn't realize that until a few weeks ago. And then, just now, I realized that this looks like a slime face as well. And I think that's the intention. It might not be. I might just be going crazy. It's probably the second one. A lot of people say I'm insane. And like, I shouldn't be this happy. But too bad. Hecking, yeah, 
it's just how I am. Can't change that. Can't change who you are for the people, cause not a good idea. Jeez, I have a lot of rock flirts. <laughs> I have so much. Well, I guess because I grow so much heartbeats and I have so many of these rock guys, they just keep me, keep me well. They keep, they keep the food on the table. This is why I need drones because you have to keep running around making sure all of the auto feeders are well kept and all the plorts are sucked out and popped into the market. If I had drones, they could just do all that for me while I go adventuring, exploring. Yeah, I'm, after this I'm going to go to sleep and hopefully I can unlock or not unlock, but like hopefully I can get a trade for for Ogden because I find his yeah, this one's from Mochi um, because I find Ogden's uh, quest thing to be really cool. Like, Mochi's, yeah, that's fine. I kind of like it. But then Ogden's, I don't know why I just like that. Okay, you're still not gone yet. You still have five minutes, or six minutes. A little less than six minutes. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm going to try and keep this episode short, guys, because the last one was a total of 30 minutes long. And then I edited it down. But obviously, the editing didn't work, as you remember. So, whatever. I'm going to try and keep this one short. Hopefully I can make it easier for me to edit because I don't have a whole lot of time and yeah, I'm will have to leave soon anyway and today as I'm recording this, today is Monday, I do not have school today so that's why I'm recording this and uploading so yeah, uh, it's really cool. Probably, since I didn't get to do a Saturday stream like I usually do because I was in Shawnee Lodge uh, for the whole weekend, but now I'm back, so I can re start recording things again for you guys, and I'm going to be doing a Monday stream, hopefully, I have to get my hair cut, so I'll probably do that after that, because that's when a lot of people will be out of school by then anyway, so yee, and I say we're, I know I say that all the time, because Lucas is apparently in it, but he's not in, he's not really in any of the videos. That's because we can just never really find time. Even though my parents don't really think like you should just stop saying we because Lucas isn't even in it, so it doesn't seem like he wants to do it. Well, he does. At least I think so. <laughs> uh, I don't know how my friends are. Anyway, uh, yeah, he is really. I think he wants to do it. I think he still wants to do it. So we're gonna try and find time to be in the same video. And by the way, reminder to the applicants for the thumbnail art contest thing. Your uh, submissions are due by the 25th, so in 10 days. You have 10 days to turn those in, because it has to be before the 26th, which is when the stream is. And we'll be doing the stream right after I get home from school, because I, my grandparents are actually doing a Halloween party that night. So I have to do it really fast and I have to get through all five chapters in that amount of time. Hopefully I can do it if I'm pretty quick, which just means less editing for me to do later when I upload all of them as a thing, as their own separate videos. So yeah, our applicants, your uh, submissions need to be turned in by October 25th. And it doesn't have to be a certain time. It could be late at night, it could be at midnight for all I care. It just has to be soon. And remember, 1280 by 720. I've messed up a lot with the size, but it's supposed to be 1280 by 720. I have it right this time. <laughs> okay, so since I'm done, I'm getting tired of just running around doing nothing, let's go exploring and let's go look for stuff because that's fun and that's what people do. So let's, let's go. I think I'll try and get, I want to get a slime that doesn't eat meat because the only slime, well the only area I have that's 
because I only have one. I only have one plot of land that has not been taken up for like you know corral or a coop or a garden or anything. That's still in my bot area. Well, I mean, I guess I do have the ones with the phosphor floor, the phosphor slimes, but that's just for phosphor slimes. And when I eventually get to it, quantums, I'm gonna mix them. I did unlock this area back here. I think I might get rad slimes because those don't eat meat. Or, you know, I can make a pond or something. I don't know. Who knows? We'll just see what happens. So, pop on through here. There's no hops and message. I already read it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. And I already did get the boom slimes in my Slimepedia. Like, I just sucked one up and then got it in my Slimepedia. If I can just... Ugh. You guys are probably thinking, like, oh, and what are you doing? This is stupid. Why are you trying to hop on a rock? Well, that's because this is actually how I get in there. Because I figured out a way to do it. You hop on here, right? Hop on this l really long rock. And you hop up here. And then you need the jetpack, by the way. And then you go over here. And then there you go. It's pretty simple. And then, boom, you get a bunch of rab slimes. I don't know why I said boom, because we're not collecting boom slimes, we're collecting rad slimes. Oh, you're a boom, you're a rad rock now. Oh, I thought that was a painted hen, because like I looked at it mixed with the rock port and it looked like a painted hen to me, which is stupid. It shouldn't, because there are no painted hens in this area. Is that a normal rad? It's a normal rad. Collect it, there we go. I don't need the pogo fruit. <laughs> These rad slimes, like, their radioactive aura thing, it has a long reach. Tar. Where's the tar? <gasps> there it is. There, got rid of him. You're welcome, slimy boys. Now you are safe from evil. No, you're not. I can still hear this tar music. Is it gone? I think it's gone. <gasps> Raddies! Okay. Uh, I think 10 sl rad slimes should be enough for now. But if I wanted more, I could just get more later. Because it's not really like a different thing, like, oh, I, after I leave, I'm never coming back to this cursed place. Probably won't for a while, though, because, you know, I already have most things in this area. Except boom slimes, I don't have those. But then the ruins I need to come back for. So that's probably it. And then after that, I could just set up a teleporter. Here, let me just... Be free, little boys. Alright, let's go home. Make a corral for these rat slimes. Oh no, I heard a tar. I want to be their savior. I am your savior. Be thankful. Because I could have just gone straight home, right then and there, just not cared. But I did care. I care about my little slimy boys. There you go, buddy. You can stay there with your friends. And you can become a beautiful, strong, rad rock. I want to be a rad rock. That sounds weird. Never mind. Um, but with the hen hens and that kind of stuff, they just... Yeah, it just takes a while for them to actually reproduce. So, yeah, just my little complaint about meat eating slimes. That's actually why I combined these with the crystals. That way they could eat vegetables. Please be Ogden, please be Ogden. Ogden! What do you want? What do you want? I'll get it. I'll get it. Just let me click off you. Carrots and pogo fruit. <laughs> Cool, I have pogo fruit right here and carrots over there. So that's neat. And I have enough pogo fruit. I was worried that I wouldn't have enough, but nah. He asked for 12. I can get him 12 pogo fruit. 
And I think before the episode ends, I'm going to try out Ogden's thing for a little bit. His little, uh, Kookamonga, Kooka, Kookadoba. That's right, Kookadoba. I had Steven Yorvis in the brain or whatever. Um, Kookadoba fruit quest thing. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. New letter from Ogden? Why no new letter from Ogden? Where's my Ogden letter? Saying, hey, you want to come down and help me out with some things? Seriously, where is it? Where is it? Garbage. Or maybe I just need to collect all of his lovely rewards. And then he'll give me his letter like Mochi did. Or, oh wait, no, he can't. He can't unlock it yet, because I don't have this place unlocked. So I need to unlock this part next, which I can do right now. Dang it, I need, now I need to make a trip with Ogden. Okay guys, so I'm gonna actually make a quick cut here to when I have a new Ogden trade, and then I'll do that. So I'll see y'all later in a little bit. And cut back. Okay, my fusioneers, so I'm not gonna be able to get to the Ogden trade. Uh, it's gonna take a little bit, I just went to sleep. And I already set up the Rad's uh, place over here, they're getting hungry. Um, so yeah, I just went to sleep. And I'm probably going to end the episode here today, guys. So thank you all so much for watching. I'll focus on the Ogden trade later off camera. And I'll try not to do as much so that way you guys can see uh, more things. Unless you like the, you know, more off camera stuff. And then we get the gist on camera and then maybe a little extra things. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. I'm just been asking you guys to tell me a lot in the comments. I guess you like comments. I don't know. So thank you all so much for watching my Fusioneers. Leave a like, subscribe, comment down below your favorite flavor of ice cream, share with a friend if you think you like this cringy content, hit that little bell to never miss one of our uploads, and I'll see you later, my Fusioneers. Peace out. Get your geek on. Bye.